What about the defense, Mary Kay? I didn't like the the way uh, Miles Garrett looked coming off the field last night. I, was there something we should know about at this point, or are we going to wait till they say something? Well, you know, he had the elbow injury, and he looked during the game when he walked off with the elbow that he was in a lot of pain. Uh, but, you know, I don't know what happened. He was only out for about five plays. He was over there on the sideline. And then he came back in, and he played the rest of the game. So I would anticipate that he will play against the Giants. He might take it easy and practice a little bit this week. He's probably a little bit sore, but it doesn't seem to be, um, from what I can tell, no structural damage, nothing that is going to keep him out for any length of time. And that's important because you just cannot be without Miles Garrett at this point in the season and heading into the playoffs. Right, so not knowing who the starting quarterback for the Giants will be, and it could be Colt McCoy, who, who ha- if uh, Miles Garrett can't do it, who has to step up and, and change that game a little bit? Well, you know, so far from everything I'm reading, it does seem like they are going to start uh, Daniel Jones, which, again, against a, a pass rush like the Browns, I just don't know if that's a good idea. I wouldn't do it. I would not do that to him. I don't think he has the mobility to get away from uh, Miles and Olivier and the guys. I would I would be starting Colt McCoy. Um, but it seems like Joe Judge is pretty committed to sticking with Daniel. Uh, so that means, you know, this could be a huge game for, for Miles Garrett. And, you know, he still wants to win NFL Defensive Player of the Year. And, you know, he could really add to his sack total in this game. 